Well, David, uh, Fed Vice Chair Lael Brainerd is speaking to the Clearinghouse Association and basically signing on to Fed Chair Jay Powell's comments from Jackson Hole, saying the Fed remains extraordinarily committed to bringing down inflation. And she says the Fed will do whatever it takes to get it done. Here's a quote from her speech. Uh, we are in this for as long as it takes, she says, to get inflation down. So far, we have expeditiously raised the policy rate to the peak of the previous cycle, and the policy rate will need to rise further. Monetary policy will need to be restrictive for some time to provide confidence that inflation is moving down to target. Now, she doesn't take a position on the September rate increase, whether it would be 50 or 75, but it is a somewhat hawkish speech. Uh, interpret that as you will. Uh, the one thing that she adds really to the uh, whole debate that uh, Powell did not speak about is the idea that uh, maybe margins are getting a little out of whack. Uh, retailers charging too much for the goods for goods over over what they pay and that there is scope for that to come down and bring down inflation. Uh, might also mention that we just had comments out from the new Boston Fed president, Susan Collins, speaking in a podcast recorded by the bank. She says she has not decided yet on whether it should be 50 or 75 September 21st. She is a voter, but that uh, she is as committed as everyone else to bringing down inflation. Well, Mike, you thought a lot longer than I have, but I think they always say they wait till they go in the room and they listen to one another another and they decide they haven't decided in advance. At the same time, given what we just heard from Leo Brainerd, uh, does that indicate to you perhaps maybe a little more in the 75 direction, a little less in the 50? It would seem that they're leaning towards 75. Now, we get that CPI report next week that will make a big difference in uh, what they do. If it doesn't come down a whole lot, then 75 is probably the base case.